Are you looking for a gift for that special photographer in your life? Or are you a photographer just wanting more gear, right? If you're either one of those, you need to watch this video. Hi everyone, welcome to pal to tech and welcome to my 2020 photographer gift guide. I'm going to start with the least expensive and move my way up to the most expensive. One of the most useful items on this list are think tank photo red whips. They're a durable, great way to keep your cords and wires organized. Photographers and videographers have cords everywhere. I think this would be a great gift for any photographer out there. It's a bit of a splurge. You get 10 of them for about 13 bucks. Coming in at number two on this list is a very handy way to attach lights, microphones, and other gear to tripods and stands. I'm talking about a special combo that I use that is a small rig super clamp and an 11 inch, I think it's called Fantaseal, I'll have a link to it down below, adjustable articulating arm. You need to get both of these together and present them at the same time because just one of these really won't work. You need to have them both. This clamps on to the item, this clamps on here, and then your photographer friend can clamp on a microphone or a video monitor or whatever else they need. These are wonderful and they're really sturdy. Once you screw this in right here and you, it's not going anywhere. Number three on the list is an SD card. As any photographer will tell you, they can never have enough SD cards. This one right here, the Lexar, along with SanDisk as well, is one of my favorite configurations. And if you note the speed at 300 megabits per second, this card is fast enough to handle any resolution of video that your Fujifilm camera or almost any mirrorless camera for that matter could throw at it. There is no way I could do a photographer gift guide without selecting a tripod. I own a lot of tripods, ranging from small to medium to larger to, you know, monster rig. My absolute favorite right now is this KNF Concept 62 inch tripod. This is the model number KFTM2324. It comes with a ball head mount, and even with the ball head mount, the entire thing weighs slightly less than about three pounds. And it's really nice because it allows you to go real far down and get low shots like this. You can flip these out just like this. This allows you to bring the camera down closer to the ground to get your shot. But as they say, that's not all, right? There's another thing you can do with this tripod that I think your photographer friends are gonna love. Unscrew the bottom right here, just like this. Take that piece off. Flip it over, unscrew this, pull this thing out, flip this over, go in through the bottom like this, see? Have a look at this. You can have your camera attached like this, see? And obviously you would need to flip the picture around in post. However, it allows you to adjust the height of this to get your camera, look at this. Next on the list and about $88 is this StarTech four slot SD card reader. This is a great unit, allowing your photographer friend to connect up to four SD cards at the same time using a USB 3.1, 10 gigabit per second speed. This really is a nice gift and it works very well. Next on the list is something every photographer has a deep, passionate interest in, and that is light. For $90, I think that this Aperture MC Amaran AL MC RGB video light is wonderful. It can recharge in 90 minutes via a USB-C connection. It gives you 100 levels of saturation adjustment and it also has an app that you can use to control the light right from your smartphone. And on the back are two magnetic plates so you can stick this to any metal surface and it will stay. It also has a screw mount at the bottom so it can attach to any standard mount. This is wonderful. And the unit comes obviously with this soft diffuser. Now, moving up a little bit in price on the list is the Tascam DR10L. This is a portable digital audio recorder which comes with a lav mic for any photographer or videographer that wants to capture good quality audio with a minimum of hassle. This entire unit is the recorder. It clips right onto you and takes a single AAA battery. It is so easy to use. 
Simply turn it on, plug in your mic, hit record, and you're good to go. Now what makes this unit so wonderful is that it has a built-in safeguard feature where it automatically records two separate audio files at the same time. The first file is your regular audio levels that you set in the unit. The second audio file that's recorded is the same as the first, except it is minus 12 decibels less. It's lower in volume. So if you screw up the audio, you clip the audio, you blow the audio out, you make a mistake, no big deal, because you can go to the second recording, which is slightly lower volume, and recover your audio. And it has saved me so many times. Okay, we're almost done with this list, and moving in at number eight is the Hollyland Mars 400S Pro Wireless Video Transmission System. I just did a complete review of this unit, so be sure to check that video out if you want to learn more about this. Essentially, the Mars 400S Pro allows the transmission of the HDMI signal to come out of the camera and into an external monitor or recording device wirelessly. It supports up to 1080p at 60 frames per second. This is definitely a splurge, but you will not find a better wireless video transmission system for the price. For our next gift, we need to have a brief moment of silence. I am, of course, talking about none other than the incredible Fujifilm X-T3 mirrorless camera. Now, this is not a cheap camera. However, last I checked, there is a Cyber Monday deal of about $999 for this camera. You will not find a better mirrorless still and video hybrid camera for that price anywhere. While I often use the X-T4, I still find that it is the X-T3 that has the perfect balance of everything you would ever want in a mirrorless camera. And for $999, if you can get it for that price, is an outstanding deal. I don't think any photographer on planet Earth would be disappointed in receiving this camera as a gift. For my last gift recommendation, I wanted to provide you with something that is completely free, but something that I think your photographer friend would appreciate this season. Here's what you need to do. First, you need to go and find one of their photos. Go to their Instagram page or their website and look through their portfolio. Look for a photo that moves you, that tells a story to you, that makes you stop and go, wow. Once you've found one, really study their photo. Look at the light, look at the angles, look at the colors or lack of colors, look at the use of space, perspective, design. Then when you're finished, get out a piece of paper and write a special note to that photographer. Title it, Why I Love Your Photo. Tell them why it moves you in the way that it does. Tell them how it makes you feel. Tell them how much you appreciate that moment that they captured and why. Then fold the paper in half and present it to them. That's absolutely free. And especially in 2020, I think that would mean the world to them. If you wanted to take this a step further, you could spend a little bit of money and you could get a copy of their photo, go to an online printing service and print, say, an 8x10 of that with your note on the back or maybe a fold card with your note and their picture on it or something like that. Well, that'll do it for this year's gift guide. I hope you found it helpful and I hope you have a wonderful holiday season. In the meantime, I'll see you in a video real soon. Take care.